Uh, yes, there are many spheres that have been developing uh, between Poland, Armenia, European Union countries. Uh, also, I would like to mention that uh, there have been cooperation between NGO sector as well, uh, because Polish NGO priorities align perfectly with Armenian NGO's priorities. Uh, plus, uh, they have been doing more businesses, and by looking at the economic data, we can see that uh, it has been more developed. Uh, for example, one of our trade partners is Poland, um, but uh, I must note that uh, there is a slight problem here because we have more imports from Poland that we have exports, uh, but in Armenia there are so many possibilities uh, to do exports. For example, in general the goods for exports are metals, uh, we have beverages, vegetables, fruits and all, but we get imports uh, such as important things as uh, oil, gas, uh, and all those kind of things. Uh, on trade, uh, we cooperate mostly with, uh, as we have a limited uh, borders for trade, we have been cooperating uh, and have well-based established cooperation with Georgia and Iran. 70% uh, of our imports uh, and transit comes through Georgia. So, uh, on the basis of business, uh, it has been on the process and it has been uh, developing and improving. Uh, it's not hard to do business, honestly, in Armenia because everyone is open. Uh, to new businesses, new challenges, and uh, entrepreneurship is, uh, I, I can't say, of course, everywhere it's difficult to do uh, entrepreneurship, but here it's, it's normal, it's common, but I have to add that we have been implemented the project uh, with Institute of Law named after after Gabriel Shershenevich within the framework of support for entrepreneurship and career growth among women in the Republic of Armenia. And the purpose and the goal of uh, this project uh, was to come together to sit and to discuss what are the problems and challenges for entrepreneurship among women in the regions of Armenia. Uh, there were many problems, of course, there were obstacles um, that need to be solved, uh, but it was a good experience because we had an opportunity to, to exchange the knowledge and to understand how everything goes in Poland and how everything goes in Armenia. There were many, of course, differences, uh, but I think it will get better. It's the honesty what you want to do exactly and give the clear uh, imagination and definition and explain your vision, what you want to do and how you want to do it. In general, uh, businessmen are very open. Uh, even here, when we try to connect people with each other, uh, they are everywhere and they say we are open, just uh, give us suggestions, how can we connect with people, what can we do, and uh, of course they listen to you, what you really want and how you imagine your business. Okay. They uh, became active, I must say, during those last 10 years. Uh, in general, uh, in politics, we had few women, uh, but right now uh, it's changing. Uh, but the situation in all regions of Armenia are still staying the same. Um, the women uh, keep the house, uh, like the housewife in general, uh, and uh, man is the head of the family and they work, they get educated, but from the, it started changes, uh, many women come here to study, to start their businesses, uh, I don't know, it, I, I can say it's changes. And there uh, are many uh, 
of different spheres that women are stronger than men. Uh, you can meet here many, uh, many women in marketing sphere, in PR, in journalism as well, uh, in even in IT. There are many women, so you can meet them. When you say Armenia, everyone imagine that there is no equality here, uh, but it's not like that. It's uh, different, uh, it's free here, there is gender equality as well. Maybe there are some spheres that uh, men are more engaged in, uh, but uh, it's to tolerate, I can say, because it's equal. So we thought that uh, there is no foundation like ours. Uh, which can be focused on various aspects, including goals, benefits uh, between two countries cooperating. Uh, so we have decided that it will be a great opportunity for us uh, to be kind of like bridge between uh, Poland and Armenia and help uh, businessmen to be connected, to cooperate uh, and develop and uh, contribute to the promotion of economic, historical, cu cultural and scientific cooperation between Poland, Armenia and the Caucasus region in general.